Hello, my name is Alessandra and this is Cooking with Ale. I wasn't really sure what to cook today, so I went to the fish market and I saw these cute little fellas and I had to get them. So today we're gonna make stuffed calamari. The first thing we need to do is clean the calamari. And we do that by grabbing this part and pulling gently. The innards should come out as well. Then we cut between the eyes and the tentacles. We grab the tentacles and open them up and we squeeze in the center to make the beak come out. Then we also gently pull out the bone from the main body of the calamari. Lastly, we just need to get the external membrane off and it should come out quite easily. You just pull it and take it off. The last step, I'm gonna show it to you here uh, so it's easier to see, but it's best done uh, under running water. So you rinse uh, the calamari and you check inside if there's any innards left and in that case you pull it out with your fingers. Then we also rinse the tentacles. Now that our calamari are clean, we can put them aside and just take the tentacles and chop them up in small pieces. Then we get a loaf of bread. We just need the soft part inside, so we're gonna take it out and then chop it up. Now we can also prepare our parsley by separating the leaves from the stems. When we've done that, we also chop it up. We're going to use a quarter of a cup for the stuffing and then we're going to use the leftover later on. We can now move to the stove top. We put the pan on medium heat. We add some oil and a garlic clove for flavor. Then we add the tentacles and cook for a couple of minutes. Then we take out the garlic, we add the bread, a pinch of salt and the parsley and cook for another couple of minutes. This will be the base for our stuffing. Now we can put the stuffing in a bowl and we also add some capers. Remember to rinse them off before adding them to the mix. Then we also chop uh, some olives and some dried tomatoes in oil and we also add them to the mix. To finish the stuffing we are also going to add an egg and mix again everything together. Now we can take our clean calamari uh, that we put aside earlier and uh, fill them with the stuffing and then we are going to close them with a toothpick. And now back on the stove top. We put the pan on medium heat, we add some olive oil and when it's hot we add the stuffed calamari and a garlic clove to give some flavor and we're also going to add some white wine. Then we cover the pan and cook from 3 to 4 minutes before turning the calamari and also adding the leftover parsley from before. Then we put the lid back on and keep cooking turning the calamari every once in a while so they get evenly cooked on all sides. The overall cooking time should be from 10 to 15 minutes. I usually use a toothpick to check the consistency of the calamari that should be tender and not rubbery. When our calamari are cooked, the only thing left to do is to plate them and enjoy their simple but tasty flavor. The stuffing we did today is one of many and I choose this one because in my opinion it's one of the most tasty. This stuffing in particular comes from the Aeoli Islands that are uh, located near Sicily. Anyway, I think uh, today's recipe came out pretty good. Um, I tried it and it's quite tasty. I really recommend you to try it. And if you have any question, please comment below or contact me on Instagram. Thank you for watching.